Aha, dinky do, hello, me hearties. Ahoy there, ahoy there. Scotty McClue, the one stop broadcaster and first lot of the internet, just for you with a Monday evening pop up, a tea time pop up, just to say hi. You can't beat a bit of hi, I say. So there you are. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Those of you who have turned on your notifications will be able to see this broadcast right away. Well done you, I say. You've got to be alert because you never ever know when Scotty McClure, the world's top broadcaster, is going to pop up just for you and say dinky do. Monday evening pop up, of course, nothing is past me. And it's also to say thank you so, 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 so much to thousands of you for watching last night's broadcast, the Sunday night broadcast, the big show. Hello, Scotty, says David Negus. Hello, David. David Dinky Do, Monday evening pop up just for you to say hi from me, Scotty McClue. Welcome, 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 I say. Sheena Wellington there watching Dinky Do, one of our finest folk singers ever. So there we are. Hello, Scotty, says Frankie Keen. Dinky Do, Frankie. Lovely to have you with us. You're watching Scotty McClue. It's a Monday evening tea time pop up just for you to say Dinky Do. Get the dinner on, Scotty, says John Adams. Yes, I know you're all at your dinner. You're all at your tea. You're all at your supper. You're all at your evening meal, whatever you like to call it. But you've still got a few seconds just to Dinky Do with Scotty McClue just for you. Can't tell where the jacket ends or the bonnet starts, Scotty lad. How are you? Absolutely. It's a suit. So there you are. Two pair of trousers, but a hole in the jacket. <laughs> uh, happy birthday to Willie from your family piece as Norman Miller. Just have a love. Hola, Scotty. Hola, Christopher. See, si, see. Si. I am from Bath alone. See, si, see. Si. Excellent. Les Hoy is watching Dinky Doo, Mario O'Donnell, and Eddie Doby Sr. Now you should all be making your tea. I want to know what you're having tonight. Are you having the boiled egg? Are you having the omelette? Touch of Francaise there. Uh, what are you at? Are, are you having mince? So there you are. So there you are. That's you having mince twice. How marvellous is that? Jenny Gallagher, thank you do. Lovely to have you with us. Now, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thousands of you have already watched the Sunday night show. Now, that's the big one. That's the one everyone's talking about. That's the one everyone is watching. And you, of course, get it live at nine o'clock on a Sunday night on Facebook Live, the world's top broadcast platform. So there you are. Lovely to have you with us. I'm just going to do a bit of sharing and you can all do the same. Just to let everybody know that we know that Scotty McClure is live the new. Just for you saying dinky do. Beef stir fry Scotty, says John Adams. Excellent. Tayab Yousef, John Rogers, Keith Watherspoon. Lovely to have you all with us. Hello Tayab. Lovely to have you with us. So there we are. Doing a bit of sharing and why not? Scotty McClure tea time pop up just for you to say dinky do. There you are. 3,665 of you have watched last night's show to date. Now keep that happening and share and share and share and share. Share and share and share. Scotty McClure all the time. Anything you see with Scotty McClure on it, share it. It's very, very important because it's all about you and I. So there you are. You and me, I think some people say, but I would say you and I. You see, classical education. Phil McCracken's watching. Didn't you do, Phil? Thought that was an order there. Good evening, Scotty. It says, John Rogers. Welcome, 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 I say. Now, what I'm doing, I'm just looking on here to, uh, I've got another device with me, and I'm just going to share. I think that's very, very important. If you've just joined us, a very, very warm welcome. You're watching Scotty McClue. We're live on the big one. We're live on Facebook Live. What's for dinner tonight, Scotty? Says John Adams. I've actually had it, John. So there you are. I had some lovely toast with a little bit of egg on it, and it was just mwah, sweet as a nut, shall we say. Fantastic. Fantastic stuff. So there we go. And uh, lots and lots to talk about. So I hope you can get your act together and get on here. Neil Emsler is watching. Thank you, do, Neil. Now, can you all double multitask? Double multitask. Not just multitask, but double multitask. In other words, can you make your tea, your supper, your evening meal, dinner, 
Right? Those of you that are dressing, can you dress for dinner while you're watching Scotty McClue live on Facebook Live? My belly will rumble till Friday, says Eddie Doby Senior. Absolutely not a problem. You're better an empty house than a bad tenant, I always say. Now, there we are. Can we get sharing? I'm just going to look and see what's happening here. So we get you sharing. There we go. Share, 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 share the post now. Let everybody know we are live. Excellent stuff. And there it goes. Now, I'm also going to share to a, a group. So there you are. Let some of the groups know. Excellent. I'll just pop up live now. Okay, live now. Now, if you can all do the same, guys. Because what we're doing, this is all work in progress. So we're looking for an optimum time. Hello, says Ned McMillan. Hello, Ned McMillan. Dinky you do from me, Scotty McClure. And a very warm welcome to you. So there we are. I'm just saying that we're live now, letting everybody know, Dinky do. And they could come and join us as well. No problem. Excellent. Right, that's that and that one and uh, a couple on here. So there we are. We'll let that one know and uh, we'll let them know. Marvellous stuff. Right, there you are. If you have anything you'd like to talk about, do let us know. Um, John Adams just had bubble and squeak with a bacon chop, says Stephen Wearmouth. So there you are, bubble and squeak. Now, who knows what bubble and squeak actually is. Uh, dinky do. I've just had a nice steak. My birthday meal, says Les Hoy. Shared, shared, shared from Les Hoy, MBE, the Dream Maker Foundation. How good is that? Nice, Steph, says John Adams. Run rig retired at the weekend. Scotty, says John Rogers. I think there's now a gap in the market for your musical talents. Yes, there's plenty of room in the market for all of us guys. Never a problem, I say. So there we are. I'm just a little bit of sharing here uh, to let people know what is what. And I'll also share to the Scotty McClure page. And if you can do the same, guys, you'll see under right post. That's W-R-I-T-E post. John Scothern is watching. Sounds like a title, gentlemen. John Scothern. Are you the Earl of Scothern? There we are. Ian McDiggle's watching. Dinky do, Ian. Lovely to know you're still about trum tum tum la bum bum hey, can I join your broadcast as a guest says Harry Knowles I don't know if I've got that facility at the moment Harry uh, what you can do for me is a little bit of sharing and uh, I'll just put live now there we are live now and do we put an exclamation mark at live now. I'm never actually sure. I think we probably do because we're exclaiming, aren't we? We're saying we're live now. It's a breakfast, really, Scotty, says Stephen Weirmouth. What is it? Are you talking about bubble and squeak? So there you are. That's what we need to know. Is bubble and squeak a breakfast? There we are. I nearly said a Brexit. It's very difficult to separate saying Brexit and breakfast. Cabbage and tatties. Is it not with meat? I don't know that there's any meat in bubble and squeak, but we shall put this out to the nation. Guys, professional uh, chefs watching. Yes, chef. Yes, chef. Service. Service, please. Uh, can you give a shout out to Jadviga Klamut? From Harry Knowles, Jadviga Klamut, yes, of course. James Ridley is watching, and uh, Jadviga Klamut. So there we are. Uh, James Byron Lee Fern and Malik Asad Ali says hi. Hi to you, Malik Asad Ali. Lovely to have you with us. Shepherd's Pie is a classic, says Louis Faber. Louis Faber, are you watching in London or Londinium, as we call it? Good evening, says James Barra. Good evening, James. Dinky do. I saw you sent me a message. Remember? I can't get messages on Messenger because if I had Messenger, it interrupts the broadcast. Paul Maxwell is watching. Thank you, do, Paul. Lovely to have you with us. I'm just going to share again, guys. And uh, this one here, I shall share on the page. Uh, there it goes. And you can do the same. So excellent stuff 
Scotty McClure, and that's us published just now. Minson Tatis is the one. Londinium, says Louis Faber Louis in Londinium Dikidu. Now, guys, if you've just joined us and you're wondering what on earth's going on, you're watching Scotty McClure, the first lord of the internet, the world stop broadcaster with a Monday evening tea time pop up just for you. Can you tell Jadwiga Clamut she needs to stop waking Halle? up at the crack of dawn. So there you are. Ronnie Crumlin's watching. Gary Cross, lovely to have you with us. And Dinky Doo from me, Scotty McClue. Capital S, small C, O, double T, I, E. That's the Scotty. The McClue, capital M, small C, capital C, L, U, E. That is the McClue. Now, would you be, there's Gary Cross giving us a thumbs up, thumbs up to you, chum. Would you be in the market, guys? Uh, very much enjoying the bunnets Stroke Jacket Ensemble, says Ian. Ian's a drum man, so he would recognize a drum rest in his sleep. Uh, Scotty, would there be a way to do the phone in as well? I think that would be popular, says John Rogers. I'm just wondering about that, John. Uh, this is a bit of a shout-out show. It started off just as one appearance, and last night we had show number 108 of our weekly shows. And, of course, we've done a number of pop-ups occasionally, but we don't announce them. They are purely random, just to see who's out there. Agree to get all the arguments going. So that's it. Can you tell Jadviga Klamut that all she does is complain, complain, complain? There we are, right. So come on here. Anik Gosh. Uh, Anik Gosh, today is my birthday, says Anik Gosh. A very happy birthday to you, Anik. And uh, welcome, welcome, welcome to the Scotty McClure Show Worldwide. Where are you watching from? I want to know where everybody's watching from. Is my coupon a bit heavy on the eye at the moment, guys? Do you want me to come back and you can take another swatch? How does that look? Uh, there we are. How, how how about that? Am I too far back then? There we are. Fell back. Uh, hi, Scotty. How are you, Sir Steve McMahon? Uh, excellent, Steve. Thank you for asking. There's Neil McWilliam there. And dinky do to him, I say, from every single one of you. For Perth, says Neil McWilliam. Now, is that Perth in West Australia? Or is that Perth in the central of Scotland, the fair city? Glasgow East, says Eddie Doby Senior. Yeah, but there's people watching, not necessarily from Scotland. So if you're watching in Canada or America or India or Africa, do let us know. I'm watching from India, says Anit Gosh. Anit Gosh, thank you. Whereabouts in India? It's always lovely to know. Uh, John Rogers is watching from Twecha. So there you are. Down the tube, Scotty. Sad day. What's that? Hang on. Uh, what about, oh my goodness me, George Burney. I shall check that out. Uh, Thomas Hamilton, didn't you do? The fair city, the gateway to the Highlands. Yes, the gateway to the Scottish Highlands. If you've just joined us, folks, welcome, welcome, welcome. You're watching The Big One with me, Scotty McClue. Not a mainstream program, just a quick Monday evening pop-up to say hi to all of you, to check you've had a lovely day, and of course to say thank you to the thousands of you who watched last night's show so far. So keep watching and um, keep sending it round. Very important. Now, <coughs> lovely. I'll just have a sip of the barley water. Mmm. Oh, that's lovely. That's absolutely lush. The barley water, put it down on the big bench there. Oi, oi, we say here. I uh, hope you've had a good day. I have had a lovely day. Thank you very much for asking. I'm just going to share again, guys. Let everybody know that they are watching Scotty McClue just the new with the quick pop-up, a Monday evening pop-up. Excellent stuff. There we are. And um, do let us know if you're watching where you are watching from. I'm missing here. Hello, Scotty from Condorit, says Gemma and Marie McCray. 
Gemma and Marie McCray. What a lovely name. Now, that is a big name. That's what I call a big name. Excellent stuff. I'm in Balloch, Scotty. Wonderful. So there we are in Balloch. We like that. So there we go. Continue. Hang on, guys. We've got a wee problem here. I've got a camera problem, so I'm just going to turn it around. Somebody must have touched the camera. I think it was me, actually. The Fair City, the gateway to the Highlands. And there's a gentleman in Balloch. Excellent. Have you ever had potato champ, Scotty? Now, what is potato champ? Tell me more. Right, there's Ian watching in Puerta del Carmen in Lanzarote. Ian McDougall, dinky-doo, sunning yourself in Lanzarote. Are you gigging at night or are you purely holidaying, I ask you. Um, hello, Sir Thomas Hamilton, hello. Uh, I don't do Scotty in Condorit, says uh, Gemma and Marie McRae. Is that a fact, I tell you? So there we are. Hope you've had a good day, says Thomas Hamilton. Yes, fantastic day, my boy. No problem at all. JP McCarran's watching Dinky Doo. A very fine fellow. Lovely to know you are out there. Michael Purcell, lots of laughs and smiles. If you've just joined us, a very, very warm welcome. You're watching Scotty McClure, the first lord of the internet and the world's top broadcaster. Also the world's most humble man along with that. So there you are, Monday evening tea time pop up really just to say hi and to say thank you to every single one of you uh, paul wilkinson watching there Gemma and marie mccray says hi john lovely 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 uh, thank you scotty not a all. Uh, I'm a neighbour, Gemma. Yes, yes, we know that. Excellent. Gosh, there's so many of you watching. Carol Carlos Donnelly. I'm back, Scott. You haven't been on for a few days. Lovely to have you with us, Carol Carlos Donnelly. So there we are. I'm in Bridge of Allen, Scotty, says Peter Dale Nevins. Dinky do, Peter Dale Nevins. And love to Bridge of Allen. A very fine part of the world. I know it well. I started the radio station for Stirling uh, 29 years ago. Central FM Radio. So there you are. Started by me. Oh my goodness me. And a lot of very talented other people as well. I hasten to add, and still on and successful, 29 years later, that's the skill. Plant the right seeds. Uh, so there we go. Good evening, Scotty. This is Michael Connor. Uh, I bet you've had tripe, says, no, do you know, John, I've never had tripe. I've sat with people while they've been eating tripe, but I've never actually had it myself. I don't really particularly care for the idea, to be honest, but I've seen it in white sauce and uh, people have it with fish. Sometimes have you ever had that or tripe and onions? So they are, but it's not um, one of my five a day. I hasten to add. So there you are. If you've just joined us, guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. Scotty McClue, the World Stop Broadcaster, with a quick tea time pop-up Monday evening, live on the big one, Facebook Live. We've got people watching from India, from Africa, from America, from Lanzarote, from Twekar and Condorit. So the world is coming to Scotland, courtesy of Facebook Live and Scotty McClue, brought to you, Dinky Do. What a privilege that is. So there you are. I'm from Mary Hill, says Thomas Hamilton. Thomas Hamilton, I can tell you, Shakespeare Street. Do you can Shakespeare Street? Garriach Road, the Mary Hill Road itself. How wonderful is that? Ortego, Ortego Street down in the West End there as well. Marvellous, marvellous. Hotspur Street, that's up near you, isn't it? There you are. Gaynor, really dinky do. Um, I'm just up the road from you, Gemma and Twecker. So yeah, the land that time forgot. Time has forgotten nothing. Twecker is now featuring massively, globally, on the Scotty McClure Show on Facebook Live. You can't say fairer than that unless you can't pronounce your Fs or your THs. I don't want you pronouncing your Fs on here if you don't mind. Macher Peverell is there. And uh, Tony Bernstein. Dinky do. Oh, sorry. Tony Bernardo. Yes, Tony, a very fine fellow. Lovely to hear from you. Do you miss the radio, Scottish is Gemma and Marie McRae? Only in as far as we could take the calls. If I can find a way to take your calls on here, 
then no problem at all. What I would like to do is find some radio stations that want to take the Scotty McClue show, and uh, what we'll do with that, we'll pan it out. You can never have too many platforms when you're broadcasting, because you really just need to connect the people with yourself. So there we are. So all of you and me chit-chatting is absolute perfection, isn't it? So there you are. It's utopia, I say. And also, it's great company for us all. You've probably heard there's a lot of people out there that are feeling quite acutely on their own. That's shocking. There's all that radio and television out there that should be looking after these people. And McClure has to pop up on Facebook Live to do that, to make sure that that void in people's lives is filled with proper quality chit-chat and decent company. Can't ask better than that, can you? So there you are. So in answer to do I miss the radio, yes, I think the radio was better for you guys because you didn't have to sit and take a swatch at my coupon. Whew. Somebody said, where are your ears? Apparently when I'm broadcasting, absolutely square on, you can't really see my ears. So I said I took them off because I don't need to listen. I just need to talk. Having a sip of the barley water. Ooh. Ah, we're chit-chatting and loving it. Absolutely. I've not heard you for years. Fantastic. I need to get this flowing there. It stopped. How do we get this flowing again? Got a customer coming to collect dog food, Scotty. I need to dash, says John Rogers. Absolutely. Woof, woof, I say to you. So there we are. Uh, Tony says, uh, Hiya, pal. Hail, hail. Tony Bernardo, always sunny in Kilburnie in Ayrshire. Scotty, you're a top man. I thank you, sir. I appreciate it, and welcome, welcome, welcome to every single one of you. Now, let's have a big share, guys. I know it's just a tea time pop-up, but let's get sharing out there and tell people what is what. All right, very important. I'm just going to share again to some pages, and you can do the same. Excellent stuff. There we are. There we go. There's my clue. Getting shared. That's what we want. And you guys can do the same, please. Excellent. Celtic FM, Scotty. <laughs> there we are. Celtic and Rangers FM. What about that? The old, old firm FM. Run by Scotty McClue. Yes, pal, says Thomas Hamilton. No problem at all. Mash tatties, buttercream and chopped leeks in one pot, says Eamon Mennery. Eamon Mennery, what are you talking about? Is that the dish, or does it have a name? Because we did ask earlier, what constitutes bubble and squeak? Bubble and squeak. Mashed tatties, butter, cream, and chopped leeks in one pot. I don't think that's bubble and squeak. Is that just a lovely, savoury dish that you serve up as a wee side dish when you're serving dinner, when everybody sits down, and the butler's there, do you say, right, uh, you can serve the mashed tatties, buttercream, and, and chopped leeks now. Thank you. Mar marvelous stuff. Tot Totty loves the batter. Right, Jordy, says John Adams. John Adams, dinky-do. How do I get this to keep scrolling up? It's stopping. I need to get it going again. So there we are. Uh, get this working. Been living and working in Lanzarote since April last year, mate. Uh, definitely not a holiday. I figured Scotland wasn't big enough for the both of us. And since you couldn't get a passport, <laughs> I thought I'd, and it says see more. But I'm not going to see more because I might lose the broadcast. I'll risk it. There we are. See more. Right. That's champ. Oh, the leeks and the tatties. In the one pot, the creamed leeks and tatties are champ. Helen Glendinning from Uddingston. Hey, Scotty. Hello, Helen Glendinning from Uddingston. Dinky do from me, Scotty McClue. Guys, get sharing. Come on. I need every single one of you to share, 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 share. I've already done it a few times. People will be starting to do their not. So there we are. I'll share to a page. How about that? There we go. Right, sharing to a page, and you can do the same. Excellent, excellent. There we are. Uh, this is so sensitive. Have you noticed that everything 
is so very, very sensitive on uh, on all the modern kit. You touch the wrong thing, finito. Scotty, my nephew's joined. Say hello to Jordan. Hello, Jordan from Uncle John Adams. Dinky do. Um, what was the best thing about being on Radio Scotty? Carl Carlos Stanley, the best thing from my point of view is that you didn't have to take a swatch at my coupon. And I accept I might not be an oil painting, but it seems to be growing on everybody throughout the world. The Scotty McClue show on Facebook Live is now one of the biggest phenomenon throughout the world. I tell you, right? I popped up last night to do my show. Thousands of you have seen that. Right now, there were radio stations that have just got their results and they don't have an audience like we have live on this program, the Scotty McClure Show, live on Facebook Live, one of the world's great broadcast platforms. So tell everybody about it. Uh, best thing about being on radio, I also was able to get all my stuff together and uh, all that here. You can see the lot, but I don't think it really matters. I don't think... It's the end of the world. Excellent stuff. Scotty, the footy Facebook groups have phone-ins and they do it through Skype while broadcasting on Facebook. Right. Well, I might do that. I might get the Skype up and we will see how we go. Loved you, Scotty, and missing you. Excellent stuff. Thank you. Chit-chatting. Love it, says Katrina McCart. Katrina McCart, dinky do, and welcome to you, to the Scotty McClure Show. Richard North's watching a very, very fine fellow down in Reading there. Excellent stuff. Lovely to have you with us, Richard. And uh, not heard you for years, you big tumshy, says James Gambini, you big Dumpshy, you're hearing me now. So there you go. It's a free for all. Hiya, pal, hail, hail, says Kieran Collins. Dinky do. Kieran Collins, I say. Uh, what have we got here? Celtic FM, Scotty. So there you are. And there's also Clyde 2 and BBC Radio Scotland as well for Scotty McClue. So who knows? Gemma and Marie McRae. I thank you. Would you like the Scotty McClue late night phone in back on the radio? Yes or no? You can say we're all up front on here. We're all pals and nobody has an agenda. We had one half witted idiot on last night. He was a Johnny come lately. He was Bairns and Idiots. Should never ever see a job half done. And uh, he was a Johnny come lately. He started cheeking up and we just blanked him, banned him live on the show. You can see it on last night's show. So there you are. Jim Thompson watching a fine fellow. Excellent stuff. Hiya, Scotty, says Lindsay Strang. Lindsay Strang, dinky do from me, Scotty McClue. Lovely to have you with us, the new. See, I'm a poet, and I didn't even know it. Excellent stuff. Uh, what was the best thing about being in radio, Scotty? Says Carl Carlos Donnelly. I think having a cup of tea without you lot knowing Scotty, you fell out the ugly tree and hit a few branches on the way down. So there you are. You should take a wee swatch in the mirror. I don't believe you're watching Facebook Live at the moment. I think you're looking in your shaving mirror. Excellent. I'll just check that you're a guy. Yes, Thomas Murphy. Excellent stuff. Thomas Murphy, look away from the shaving mirror and have a wee swatch at McClure's Coupon. Woo! If you've got a problem with Scotty McClure... That's your problem. Excellent stuff. Right, good man. We've done it. Helena Innes is watching a fine, fine lady. Dinky do to her, we say. Top totty, your patters bro. Thank you very much indeed. Excellent stuff. So many of you on here. Potato champ, when are you coming to Cumbernauld Theatre, Scotty? Well, of course, as you know, the Cumbernauld Theatre was the home of uh, an audience with Scotty McClure. How amazing was that? Dinky do, I say. Now, uh, what's happening here? It's seven o'clock. I'd love a phone in, Scotty, says Russell Rook. The Scotty McClure late night phone in on as much national and international radio as we can muster. So there you are. Now, I've, I've been talking to a lot of the big media groups, very, very senior meetings with very, very senior people. And as you know, there was one media mogul when his programmer, his chief exec programmer said to him, can we afford to have Scotty McClure? 
he said, can we afford not to have Scotty McClure? So there you go. If you want your voiceover done for your adverts, if you want me to come and speak to you in public, if you want me to come speak to uh, even small groups, don't worry about the budget. If I believe in you, I will sort out a budget to suit you. All right? So don't panic. Oh, he will want Mega Gal. There's no way we'd ever get Scotty McClure to come and speak live to us. But think about it, as I say, if I believe in what you're doing, I'll find, I'll adjust the budget to suit you. How about that? I can't say fairer than that. Right, what have we got here? How are you, Scotty? So Robert Peck. I'm dinky do Robert. Lovely of you to come with us and get sharing, guys, as quick as you possibly like. Uh, lol, all right, John Bro says, <laughs> it's wonderful. Guys, how do I get this to keep strolling? It stopped. So there you are. I stopped it, and now I can't start it again. So how do I do that? What do I press? to get it to keep scrolling again. What happens if I press that? Oh, no! <laughs> Excellent. Right, we're still there. Did you get a funny screen there, guys? Scotty, 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 it's a pleasure to have a face to the voice. Go on yourself, big man, says Ian Burke. Wonderful stuff, Ian Burke. It's lovely to know you're out there. And I say dinky-doo to every single one of you watching tonight. Fantastic stuff. So there we are. Wagner. Um, happy birthday. I don't know what he's on about there. Councillor Henry Anderson, dinky-doo from me, Scotty McClure. Amanda McCrimmon. Yes. Now, Amanda McCrimmon, are you part of the famous McCrimmon piping family? So there we are. Like and share, 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 Scotty Hill Hill, says Gemma and Marie McCree. Gemma and Marie McCree, I think you need to scroll. I'm scrolling, but how do I get it to move up? Uh, a messenger group call, says Carl Carlos Donnelly. Now, Carl Carlos Donnelly, I can't actually download the messenger to this device or it interrupts the broadcast. This is the worry. It actually interrupts the broadcast and we end up with a wee bit of a problemo. So there we go. Happening, Scotty, mate. No problem at all. Uh, Paul Lee uh, and Lindsay Strang, John Adams. <coughs> Marvellous. Graham McFarlane, good man. Hello from Coatbridge, Scotty boy, from Katrina. Um, hi, Scotty. Funniest nights ever listening to you for many years. Buckled, says Amanda McCrimmon. Now, come on, Amanda. Face up, step up to the plate, cough up. Tell us, are you one of the great bagpipers, the McCrimmons? Now, just giving myself oh, what we call oh, what we call a comfort break. It's actually a mop doing a swatch with a clout. So there you go. Yes, we had some great fun in the radio, and there's lots more to be had. I can tell you that for nothing. For nothing. So there we go. Hey, from Mary Hill. There we are. Pauline McClement is up in Mary Hill there. How fabulous, Pauline. We love that. That is brilliant. Robert Jones, could you come to Coat Bridge? Of course I can. Say hi to Tory Glenn, says David Crockwell. We all say hi to Tory Glenn. We always say hi to Tory Glenn. Guys, if you've just joined us, you're wondering what on earth is happening to your Facebook. It's come alive with me, Scotty McClure, the one stop broadcaster and the first lord of the internet, broadcasting globally to all countries of the world. Dinky do, I say. There are 1.8 billion people on Facebook, and if we can get them all in a Facebook Live broadcast, that would be fabulous. So if the old algorithm would open up and accept the Scotty McClure show, and let's just see how how far we get worldwide. Keep your hand in your hit me. We love you, Scotty, says Pauline McClement. Thank you, Pauline McClement. I love every single one of you. You are beautiful, beautiful people. Don't forget that. So there you are. Excellent stuff. Now then, happy birthday to me, says Paul McClement. Scotty, get something sorted 
about the recipe for a very famous drink. You're better looking now, Scotty. You're much younger. The pram's not got the shutters anymore. Ah, you'll be celebrating tonight, of course, eh? Getting the stabilizers off your bike. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Can you say hi to Marie Maguire? Says Pauline. Of course I can, Marie Maguire. Dinky do and hi from me, Scotty McClue, and from everybody throughout the universe who's watching this program right now. Dinky do. Can we share again? Everybody got to share? Come on, let's go for it. People will go bananas, but it's a share. It's not the end of the world. So I shall put a live now. L I V E N O W. Live now, and I'll share to a page uh, on your page. And my page tonight is a uh, Scotty McClue, global radio and television producer and presenter. So there you are. If you want to do business, get yourselves on there, guys, and we will do a little bit of business. You should be able to see me there as well excellent stuff so that's it that's scotty mcclure and uh, who else have we got here happy birthday to me yes we've said that aiden noon from uh, paul lee i think you need to scroll right to the bottom oh my goodness i used to be a piper but it was when i worked in the bakery a piper he used to pipe the cakes <laughs> We love it. I went to a wedding the other day. It was so sad. The cake was in tears. Uh, you should be doing pantos as Paul Lee. Do you think I'm not a good pantomime dame? Right now, boys and girls, we're all going to sing. My half's going to do better than his half. Excellent stuff. Hello from Devon, says Ryan Finlay. Hello, Ryan. Scotty, we grew up as kids knowing you. A wee throwback. Uh-huh. Ooh. That barley water's beautiful, guys. There's Thakur Sharma. Lindsay Strang, excellent. It's crashed, it's crashed. What's crashed? You've crashed. I hope you haven't. Hope it's just your your uh, internet's crashed. What's in that drink? You have a wee dram in there, Scotty boy. Woo! Woo! <laughs> Imagine that on your steamboats. Oh, well, did it. I love you, Scotty, says Gemma. Thank you, my darling. Thank you, Scotty, says Pauline McClement. Excellent stuff. I think we're getting down to the bottom of this now, folks. So that's wonderful. And it's been great just popping up to see you. The Scotty McClure Show with a tea time pop-up. This is not the big show goes out at 9 o'clock sharp on a Sunday evening, live here on Facebook Live. Okay, thank you, Scotty. No bother. Ben Geddes says hi. Now, guys, I take applause or derision on my merits. This is absolutely free, 108 shows free, gratis, and for nothing. But if you fancy putting a fiver in Scotty McClure's PayPal just to help to grow the show, it goes towards advertising and little bits of equipment. As you know, I've put hundreds of thousands of pounds into radio in my lifetime, and it would be great just to get a wee hand with the advertising. What about Scottish? STV2, Scotty. And we're going to have a phone-in show. There, are, I think STV2 is a closing or has closed uh, i'm not sure i'll need to just check on that uh, the bbc fantastic uh, coverage i've always loved the bbc's technical quality i remember working at bbc radio scotland and bbc television and uh, radio 4 and uh, all that sort of thing. Tremendous stuff. Uh, Susan Terrace, hilarious. Could you say hi to Karen Peck, says Robert Peck. Of course I can, Robert. We can say hi to both of you. So there you are. And uh, do you like my pecs? Excellent stuff. Now, uh, there you go. Not, 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 listen, a wee joke, just a wee joke, Robert. Light-hearted banter, you know, banter. Right, uh, so there you are. Goodbye, pal, says Thomas Hamilton. Are you away, chum, or am I away? Who knows? One of us is away. So there you are. Uh, BBC bias, says Paul Lee. No, I don't think there was any BBC bias on the Scotty McClure show. I can assure you, I don't think there was any bias at all. You either like Scotty McClure or you don't, but it doesn't matter because you will always watch and you will always listen. So you might as well sober up, front up, step up to the plate and tell the truth.
Excellent. Scott Biddy is watching. Hi, Scotty. Long time no hear. Used to love the fun in and Scott of him. Loved it, says Archie Moody. Archie, lovely to have you with us. And dinky do. this is the big one. Scotty McClure, live on Facebook Live. We've done 108 shows. You'll see them up on YouTube. Scotty McClure's YouTube channel. So there you are. Get yourself on there. Oi, oi, dinky do, says Scott Biddy. I think STV um, is two is going to close just now, says Gemma and Marie. Ah, right. Hi, pal, says Neil McCallum. Ha ha! You know what I mean, says Polly. Oh, mum's the word, Paul. There we are, not a word. Zip it. There we are. That's what I say, Paul Lee. Uh, never a problem. Uh, so there we are. Half wit, says Martin Campbell. Martin, you're being very hard on yourself. Most people usually start with an introduction, so it should say Martin Campbell from Bunkle or um, uh, Twecha or something like that. You shouldn't just come on and call yourself a half wit. All right, there you are. That's what I call harsh. And if it was about anybody else, I would say it was savage. Right, there you are. So, Martin, be a bit less hard on yourself, I say. Dinky do from Scotty McClure. Right, I'm just going to sit back. Uh, we do a Scottish Jeremy Kyle show with you, Scotty, says Jeremy. Do you know Jeremy Kyle followed me in Manchester? When I left a job in Manchester on Century Radio, Jeremy Kyle took over. There you are. <coughs> You're some man, Scotty, says Andy McFarlane. So are you, Andy McFarlane. It takes two to tango, I always say. Now, I hope you're enjoying yourselves. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This was just a short tea time pop-up. So I will be pushing off very soon. I didn't know you were still alive, Scotty, says David Campbell. Not only alive, David Campbell, but kicking. And apparently looking younger than I did 20 years ago. Excellent stuff. I didn't know I was alive until you told me. It's fantastic news. I'm just... Woo I'm buzzing now. I'm on the uh, on the barley water. Law love it, says Archie Moody. Ha ha ha, says Martin Campbell. Ha ha, ha Martin. There you are. Nothing gets past me. So there we go. Mr. Smarty Pants. What about that? Right. Now, I think, uh, what should we do here? Um, we've got many, many things we can talk about. We're talking about bubble and squeak. A wee shout out for wee Charlotte Scotty, says Andy McFarlane. Yes, wee Charlotte McFarlane. Dingy doosh. Keeping nice and quiet. So I hope she's going to read a Beatrix Potter book or something or have one read to her now. That would be nice. Or a wee bit of wind in the willows. Lovely. You can't beat that to get the wee ones off to sleep. So there we go. What's this going on here? I'm hearing myself coming back. Uh, that won't be the first time, I can assure you. It's, it's just one step away from meeting yourself coming back. I'm looking for a pair of mumbling pants, says Robert Nielsen. I don't think you'll get anything to fit you, Robert. It tends to be more of a lady's garment, if you get my meaning, you know. Mum's the word. Lips are sealed. Uh, so there you are. You look younger, Scotty, says Gemma. I think so. Everybody says you look a lot younger than you did 25 years ago, Scotty. So you can't beat that, can you? David Campbell there and uh, sending lovely, lovely things as all of you are now. Can you all share this broadcast right now, guys? Just share, 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 share. All right, so every single one of you. Tony Bernardo, I remember listening to your phone end in the car, snuggling into my boyfriend, now husband, Tony Bernardo. I hope you're back on the radio soon. I might get another snuggle. Dinky do. So that's from Mrs. Bernardo. She's using Tony's Facebook, of course, and uh, she snuggled up to Tony, and they are together, big style. Cameron Erich, what a lovely name that. You should be knighted. I would like to hear Sir Cameron Erich. There we are, for services to the Scotty McClue Show. Listening to Scotty in the posher part of Bridge of Weir and sitting drinking a Long Island iced tea. Hawdy haw, Scotty. Hody ho, Mr. Ericht. So there you are. What a wonderful name. They were Cameron Erich. So they are Sir Cameron Erich. I salute you, sir. 
Marvellous. So there we are. Scotty, I know your son, Karaoke Night, used to be one of the, the best nightclubs in Glasgow. I'm a black belt in karaoke, I will have you know. So there you are. Maybe they're both called Tony, says Eddie Doby Sr. Ah, good thinking, Sherlock. Nothing gets past you. Dr. Watson's on his way. Uh, so excellent stuff. Philip Bogle's watching. Dinky Doo. Lovely to have you with us. You're watching Scotty McClure. And this is just a quick Monday evening pop-up to say hi to all of you. We've got people watching in India, in Africa, in Canada, in America, in Australia, and New Zealand. What about a Scotty Scotland karaoke sing-song? Gorgeous idea, but of course you'd be into copyright with the music. So there you are. So a little bit of a problem from that point of view, but I know exactly where you're coming from. And it's fabulous stuff. So there you are. A Scotland karaoke sing-song. Can every single one of you share? Let everybody know what we're broadcasting live right now. Dinky do I say. I don't know if I dare share any more wonderful stuff. We might manage one. So there we are. What have we got here? And we'll see if we can get somebody on here. Excellent stuff. Right. And um, there they are, talking on another radio station at the same time as us. And uh, they don't have as many people, I don't think. And they're talking about Brexit. So there you are, the Brexit. I think they should scrap that Brexit thing, to be quite honest. Anne Bernardo, Tony's wife. Excellent, Anne. Dinky do. We had an idea of that. Hello, sir. I'm viewing from Lanark, says Jennifer Ross. Jennifer Ross, dinky do. And lovely to have you viewing from Lanark, a fine part of the world. I passed through Lanark a couple of weeks ago on my way to Peebles. There we are, I was going down to Peebles, and I went via Lanark. Is that a sensible way to go? The road is a bit windy, and we got stuck behind somebody doing about 30 when there was nothing in front of them, and braking on the bends when there was nothing in front of them. They are frightening, frightening. Could have written a lot of us off. Hello, sir. So there we are, excellent stuff. Stevie McKenzie's watching Dinky Doo. If you've just joined us, guys, and you're wondering what on earth's going on, you're watching Scotty McClure, the world's top broadcaster, the big one, the one everyone's talking about, and the one everyone is watching. This is the new television. When did you ever see such a fine piece of television? vision, not interrupted by commercials. Excellent stuff. Share, Scotty, says Gemma and Marie McRae. Very much appreciated, Gemma. Thank you for the share, I say. I'm just doing the same myself here. A little bit of sharing. <clears throat> you can't beat it. What is it with pensioners? My dad keeps calling Brexit Bretex, no matter how many times he's told it's Bretex. I don't know what Bretex is. It sounds like maybe something you might uh, take to freshen your breath or to make you more British or something like that. Great to hear your voice again, says David Gallagher. Lovely to be with you, David. And dinky do from me, Scotty McClure. Susan Terrace, your rendition, Mrs. John McDougall, a favourite party piece of an evening. She loved it. What was that you were saying? I missed it. It flashed past. Gary Johnston Smith, dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. Right. I think it's time I pushed off, guys. Lovely to be with you. Now, when I go, please, I beg of you, I don't mean go as in, like, go, you know. I don't mean that. I mean, just go for the evening. Can all of you share this broadcast and carry on sharing it randomly? Share, 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 share. And share it globally. Share it with all your groups. As I say, if you want to put a fiver into PayPal, go on to the Scotty McClue website, www.scotty-mcclue.com. You'll see PayPal is 100% secure and send us five or ten or whatever you think just to help grow the show. So it's very much a favour we're asking for there. We're begging for a favour. People say they don't like beggars. Scott McClure doesn't beg. You know what I mean. It all goes to help. Excellent. And it means that you've helped to grow the show. But only if you can spare it. All right. Very, very important. Now, who else have we got here? Oh, crowd of you coming on here. Fantastic stuff. What a great pop-up. This has been a great Tuesday evening tea time pop-up. So there we are. I'll maybe give you a wee tune just to say hi. Wait to see if I can. I'm quite sure I can. Shall I give you a tune? 
What would you like? Um, what about a wee number? Did you like that? Anybody know what it's called? Bye bye, Scotty. Good night, my dinner. See you, Gemma. Pistol chandelier. See you, Sunday, Scotty. To every single one of you, thanks for watching. This is Scotty McClue saying dinky doo to every single one of you. Ta la, lost.